Okay guys, you asked for it, and this is a tutorial um, for the third map, code is in the description, here we go. So first thing you want to do, get on the ice, glide down here, you can take a team bit of fall damage, I see you want to come and angle this way, and get here. Now, all right, come, uh, you, you kind of want to jump up and down prevent yourself really fast to prevent, prevent yourself from falling is you'll give yourself jump fatigue now you get up here by jumping on the bush and once you get to level 2 you need to go down here trigger this trap come in here so before you watch any further I would like you guys to actually try this map out by yourself first come here as a last resort. Then you jump up here, jump to that stone, and then up on here. These jumps are fairly self-explanatory. This one's probably the hardest to get. And then you get up on the small head. So this is where it gets um, kind of tricky, where you need my tutorial. Get on here, and get down here and underneath and you can come out into this next section from here you go into this door it's a lot of exploring but you can just skip it all if you follow what I'm doing now you actually want to go up here and down to this one trigger this trap and come up here come on and get up here Jump here, and then jump onto this platform. And once you're up here, oops, you jump on here. Be careful not to fall down there. You actually want to jump on on this side. That down there is a decoy, and going up here must be like, oh, it leads you back to level two. But you do the jump around thing again. Once in here, there's a trap, and you have to dodge it, and now you're in the four symbol is kind of covered by this thing. this level four. You go forward and you crouch, go sideways, and turn to south. You go forward again and you get into this mirror maze. From here you wanna follow me. This room is pretty hard to get by. Um, getting past this first jump is kind of tricky. There. Yeah. Good luck. And then on this level here, get to one of these doors. I recommend this, this level is probably the easiest. Trigger this trap. Come up here to the lamp and get this then go over on this thing jump down here with the bamboo and from the bamboo I want to jump on this thing start with that then from here you jump on here jumps are pretty easy you get onto this sign Here and up onto this part. And from here, you jump here and up on this chair, and you get up here. Once you have the ice, you put down the booster here if it's not already there. Jump up. You might have to do it a couple times. Get all the way up. And now uh, you've made it to level 6. Probably the most difficult. And the reason it is is because you have to jump very to get here. First thing you want to do is 
come from here to here and get in there and there's a trap you have to watch out for and then there's an ice trap that you need to get. You jump up here, up here, it's kind of, it's, it's are really glitchy so and it won't, it won't allow you to jump the entire thing. So this one, I think is over here. Somewhere in the middle for these ones. Like that. But you see the picture. And then from there you jump here. And up here, once in the middle again. Maybe team it to the right. really glitchy you have to watch out and then on this part you want to jump around like that and right here will shove you off oops and up here you want to get to the edge of this log and jump here and jump onto the rock and up here you put down your ice strap head down all the way here Now you're on level 7. On level 7, you could try it all the way and jumping over to the sledge, but what, what you actually want to do is slow down right here. And that doesn't give a. And you come down here. Hey. And now you'll make it to level 8. If you did make that jump there, you'd end up getting to this wall and you can't fit. Parkour. You have to jump up when you land on here to dump the trap. These jumps entire maze are tested and possible. Some are just very difficult to be careful. This is meant to take some time. back over here. Ever jump that you jumped here. And up like that. Like that. This. This jumps pro these last two jumps are probably the most difficult. That and then you have to jump up. And then while the traps and you have to be careful of this buzzer while the trap's still charging. You have to go like that. This is probably a very difficult level. And now you've made it to the very end. Or not the very end. Um, but like there's one level that will lead you to the very end. So if you look around, you'll see this object over here that you can jump on. And then you can jump on the next one. And then up here, get up onto the sledge. This will take you to a decoy room. That will take you to a decoy room. And this will take you to a decoy room. So even if you try those all out, those are the wrong way. You actually want to go over here and jump over here. Sorry about that. Get up here. And then if you fall in there, you'll die. So you want to do the same strafe. And if and the lands here. We have to keep going forward. Off. Get up here. Get the checkpoint. And back up here. Door maze. Figure out on your own. There's a couple levels. I don't want to spoil it for you because there's a trick, and once you get the trick, it's pretty easy. And checkpoint on. You have a plane, and you have a jump pad. Take you to the entire. So I'm um. I assure you all the jumps are possible. I might have I might have missed a couple, but um, I haven't practiced this map for a while. So anyway, here's the tutorial if you needed it. Um, hope you guys enjoy, and thanks for watching. Make sure to like the video if you guys want a fourth map.
My fourth map will be a teeny bit different. It'll probably be more of a story. Have more of a story in it. And probably probably more puzzles and more. Um, or maybe, but it'll, the parkour will be more hidden, I guess. It'll be more built into the infra infrastructure, so. And 